What is going on guys? As you can see, we're in something a little different here today. A little more fancy. That's right. So we will be filming this whole segment in here because the wind noise is a little ridiculous today out in uh, at wholesale. So uh, let's just jump right on into it. So we can show you guys some cinematics and us popping the, uh, the hood and the frunk. But uh, we're going to try to keep all the audio inside the car so that the video can actually turn out well. Actually here. Right. So Alcantara everywhere is my first impression. Literally everywhere. Like roof, the pillars, doors, steering wheel, shifter. Places you don't even need it. All of this transmission right. housing everywhere. Everywhere is Alcantara. I love it. And this is the 7-speed Porsche PDK. I'm not even going to try to pronounce what PDK Why stands not? for because it's it is, it's, it's like Porsche Doppelkung or something you know it's something <laughs> just, fucking ridiculous it's just said you weren't gonna try it has like 30 letters in that friggin pronunciation so it's all right but uh this this is so awesome and of course they have their iconic keys that look exactly like the cars so that's just even better paint matched and everything paint matched and all so we have a little infotainment here as well as all your options, as well as the, uh, this is how we die button right That's there. That's right. Because uh, you turn trash control off in this car, you, you in for a treat. A, a sick drift for a couple seconds and then you're... So you smack a tree or something. You're going to hit a tree. But, you know, that's all right. This car revs up to 9,000 RPMs. Top speed on the dash is 225 miles an hour, but it is governed to 199 from the factory. I love the increments on it. Oh yeah, they go in quarters. to 50, yeah. 75. Yeah, they're going quarters. It looks then, like you you're know. barely going at 50 miles per hour. Yeah, that's hilarious. Like, Porsche is telling you to uh, speed your ass up. This, this car is made for, uh, you know, the Nuremberg or, you know, the Autobahn <laughs> or something, you know. 50 miles an hour is just chump change in this car. But, this is a 2016 Porsche GT3, not the RS. So this is the 3.8 flat six, 475 horsepower, 3,100 pounds. It has a uh, six pound, 6.1 pounds per horsepower, if I'm not mistaken. <laughs> and uh, this is this is a car. <laughs> this, this is, is a, a crazy car. car. We have a roll cage from the factory, as well as these wicked seats. Now, these are fully electronic seats as well, so you can actually move these. These are not stationary. That's too much weight. But, uh, yeah, you know, electronic, too much weight. Way you know? too much. But transmission housing right there because, you know, this is a rear engine car. And you got, you know, the makeshift seats. You know, I mean, I'd throw a kid back there. Yeah, you can fit them right in between the roll cage. That's they right. Wouldn't, they won't even move. You know, this this is a family car. I don't know what you're talking about. Nice shelf. That's right. You go. got the... Couple the Wang. Key tags. Oh yeah, the key tags, but you know the the Wang City back there yeah, too. Yeah, it's a nice rear view. Of course. Now uh, we will also include an exhaust clip, and this thing definitely Sounds ridiculous does not have a stock exhaust in any way, shape, or form. So that is just amazing, and uh, we have some nice audio in here as well. You know, lots of lots of cool stuff. It's a really nice. This is your active exhaust, which is gone in this car. They ripped that yeah. straight out, and it sounds like they went straight pipe, like just complete they did. straight, which is amazing. I'm not complaining in any way. You also have the lift. Yeah, it's like it's so you don't you know destroy your front bumper. Supercar things. That's right. These are so low. Yup. You have your PDK Sport mode, your active suspension mode, and your death buttons, <laughs> <laughs> and the lock and unlock, as well as your hazards. Of course the pdk then you have all of your air conditioning controls up here as well as your media now this car did have a radar detector fun it facts did. and uh, i guess the owner took that out before he traded it it's in gone now but uh these seats are so comfortable oh yeah this whole car is comfortable like you know for the fact that these seats look like they're just metal and it feels so good oh yeah <laughs> but incredible Unfortunately, this review will have to be, you know, sort of on the lower end. I mean, not yeah. the lower end. I mean, we're definitely going to show the car off and show you guys all the cool stuff it has. But, you know, we can only start it. We're not going to be able to drive it. Um, these cars are very expensive. High and end. Yeah, they're, they're on their high end lot. So we will not be able to take them out. But we can, of course, start it and show off the car. So that's yeah. what we're going to do. We really do appreciate them letting us. Of course. I mean, 
shout out to Wholesale with Matt and Chad. You guys have been great, awesome to work with, allowing us to start these cars and uh, do a review on them. That's right. So, I mean, this is definitely going to be awesome on the channel. I mean, it's a it's, it's a, a GT3. GT3. I mean, like, come on. How many people can say that they've been in a GT3? Uh, we can. Feature number one. Cup holders. Cup holders. That have been used. This car has been used. That's right. Somebody Somebody went to McDonald's every day in this, this car. This was not a car that sat in a garage yeah, its whole life. Not. Now, I think this does have like 16,000 miles on it. So you just shove the key right in there. And then the car comes alive. Nope. You have your... Porsche badge. This was your GT3 pop up there on the dash. Got some tunes and right some there. tunes. And it also pops up right there along with that. Now this does have 16,936 miles on it. So that is awesome. It was used. I love it. I love seeing supercars used. It makes me happy. It's really cool. There's no push to start. You just shove the whole key in there. It looks that's like a right. car. Shove like, the whole key in there. I mean, that's that's one of the coolest features of this car, too. This key. Yeah, that key is. Because, nice. look at this thing. It's same color as your car. Yeah. I mean, this key's got a little, you know, it's been used, but don't, don't worry about that. It's got the badge up front, your unlock, lock, and I your frunk opening, as well as your panic on the back. Yeah. And that's where the battery would go. I didn't do it. What me. No, dang. Well, I mean, the thing's right there, so I don't know how you would have done that, but, you know, it's okay. But we have these slick paddles on here as well, and the badge. Porsche. 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 <laughs> oh, did you say Porsche, right? Yeah, I said Porsche. A Are few sure? times. Are you sure? I don't know. I'm combining them. We're going to get just chopped up in the comments. That's okay. You also have this GT3 badge right here with the PDK. And uh, this, is, this is so nice. It's still a nice luxurious feeling with a car that can literally throw like two G's around a track That's and right. just take off whenever it pleases. I mean, if you push that gas, it's taking off on you. Cause this, this car is designed, the GT3 series was designed for the track. That's right. And so at any given time, this thing's gonna do it. Just step on it. That's right. So guys, what do you think of the car? Leave comments down below. I love it. I mean, I want it. I, I do want one. But I want that Huracan over there that they're having to put gas in right now. That is also pretty nice. We will check those out as well, possibly. The uh, the two Lamborghinis are locked, the uh, red Gallardo and the white Huracan. But that's okay because we have a, a little Cayman GT4 right next that's door. That's a seven speed manual. That is a seven speed manual. Are you sure? Wasn't it? I think it's a six speed. It should be a six-speed manual, seven-speed PDK. I don't know. I don't know Porsche. Well, dang. Porsche. You just Porsche. Corsa. Corsa. I don't know these cars. Borla. Borla. <laughs> exhaust. <laughs> what, what exhaust on this? One? <laughs> I don't know. I can't find <laughs> it. <laughs> now we could not rev this car either because this thing is so freaking loud. It vibrate. It we vibrated put... the entire interior when I started it. And I was standing behind it. Oh, yeah, I bet that was deadly. Which we could probably put that clip right now. You know. It's somewhere. It'll be right here. That is... That, 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 Crazy. This is the loudest car I I've ever it. been behind. I love it. I thought the Z06 was crazy. You thought that Z06 was loud. <laughs> we were afraid to rev that. Oh, I don't want to rev we this. We were actually terrified to rev this car. <laughs> Look, this thing's stupid loud. Like, I swear to God, he took the header and just curved it on down. These tips are huge. He looked up in there. He was like, okay, anything looks like exhaust. Yeah, just go. It's got to go. Take it out. Get rid of it. There are two <laughs> tips back there. Oh, they're like a fist each. Like, easily. They might both be two fists. Oh, they're huge. Did I you mean, get them in the cinematics? Yeah. Alright, cool. Like well, then, you guys already saw them, but... They're love absolutely it. insane. Absolutely love it, guys. So, with that being said, I mean, we've gone over pretty much everything in the interior that we can, anyway. Uh, I mean, your little glove compartment there. A lot of storage. That's right. It's a race car. I don't need that. Of course. You also have 
a cigarette lighter because yeah, all smoke Germans, your... <laughs> all German cars still have this cigarette lighter. In case you want to smoke in your brand new Alcantara covered Porsche. That's right. You can do it. Indeed. Well, guys, we'll throw in the uh, the clips of the frunk and the hood opening. You won't be able to see a lot with the hood because it is a complete carbon fiber cover. However, that doesn't stop us. We you will show you. see it. That's right. But with that being said, guys, hope you enjoyed this review. And uh, we like, got a comment, and subscribe. Oh, there's just a few more. We got a, we yeah. got a great list coming for you guys today. So uh, this Corvette is better than that. Well, way to go. What? Just lost all our fan base. Dang. <laughs> <laughs> all right, guys. We will show you all that and then uh, move on to the next one. That's right. All right, guys. Like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, catch you guys later. Kerchow. Kerchow.